healthy ones. Well, let's just get rid of all this nonsense we don't really want. These. Alright. And what I would like is the Grandmaster's Calcinator, just because that would really lighten the load, considering the Calcinator is some of, one of the most expensive parts. And we'll give you our Master's Calcinator for it. And you can give us a better deal than that. About 830. Of course. So now I have Grandmaster's Calcinator, Mortar and Pestle, Retort. All that's meant left is the Alembic. See how many more Store Fatigue Potions we can sell in order to make that possible. Apparently a lot. Alright. Well, let's require the ingredients necessary to do what we want to do again. And in fact, let's make a whole bunch of levitate potions. As well. I think if you hold the shift key, yeah, it selects all of them. <laughs> Might as well buy some frost salts as well. Yes, of course I'm over in Cumbria. That's because I'm about to make an absurd amount of stuff. Work, 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 working for my money, working for my money. Too bad alchemy isn't one of the prize skills. You get your practice it mighty quickly. Your manufacture in bulk. Okay. So now that we've made an absurd amount of restore fatigue potions, we will sell off some of them. In exchange for hey, a Grandmaster's Alembic. Where is it? There it is. We'll offer up our own Master's Alembic in exchange. And we will also buy Frost Salts. And let's call it 482. Okay. Here, now we have all Grandmaster's equipment. Excellent. Doesn't get any better than that. Actually, I want to make 20 Levitate Potions. Um, I did type in a name. 
Odd game bugs. Need to type in a name. Like, I don't know. Levitate, maybe? Why is it doing that? It's a very odd bug. Let me put it over here. There we go. Type in a name. I already did type in a name. I don't know why it says that. Okay, let's try this again. Coming around it from this direction. There we go. Alright, let's make ourselves some Restore Magicka. Fantastic. Alright, let's see what we can sell off. Hmm. 12, 17, 3, 3, 12. Way more fatigue than I know what to do with. So we'll be needing to sell a lot of these, actually. Twelve. And get rid of the small quantities. Just to free up inventory space and simplify things considerably. And get rid of the fortified personality crap. I've got plenty of levitate potions now. Cure poison, cure blight, fire shield. Fine, I'll keep that. Restore fatigue. I have three of those. Definitely need to sell one of them. I guess this one. And, uh, huh, apparently need to bring down the cost of everything that I'm trading with her. Hmm, diamonds? Why not? Diamonds are nice. Girl's best friend, they say. Another batch of Restore Fatigue Potions. I mean, how many do you really need to carry around with you? Especially with the way I can go through them. Yes, I am getting them a rather generous deal, but... I don't know what really else I can ask. And she really doesn't have anything else that I'd really be all that interested in. And then there's the Void Salts. I guess I could ask for some of that. And just say Max Sale. Take all that money. Thank you for doing business. Okay. And Abril just cheesed his way into an outrageous fortune. Alchemy scale literally exploding through the roof. <laughs> Levitate. Oh, the hell with it. It's one of the potions. It's practically a walking alchemy lab at this point. Though he's got the finest equipment and a whole heap full of money now. She's certainly not complaining about. Suppose there is a reason why a lot of people go into business. Should rent himself a room and rest. After making all that money and engaging in all that alchemical practice, obviously exhausting himself in the process, it would seem like a reasonable thing to do. Oh, I don't actually need anything there, but 
Yeah. Yeah. Moon sugar. It's funny to see. Bits, please. Yes, indeed. Thank you. All right, 12 a.m. I was exhausted. It's going to rest for probably 16 hours. He tends to rest for very long periods of time when he does. Send it to level 6, and you are awakened by a loud sound. Sense yourself becoming more aware, more open to new ideas. You've learned a lot about Morrowind. It's hard to believe how ignorant you were, but now you have so much more to learn. Getting 5 to intelligence. Two to personality and apparently two to strength, because there's very little else to worth fortify with the uh, multipliers that they offer you. Oh dear, there seems to be an assassin after me. Isn't that darling? Well, second barrier belt. Boom. Amulet of admonition. Come here. Gotcha. Alright, well let's have fun with you. Let's see if we can steal your soul. Your spell did not get a target. Oh, you can't steal the soul of people. How disappointing. Uh, how about we poison you to death? That sounds fun, doesn't it? You enjoy that, don't you? Oh. He had an iron spider dagger. A nice little piece. And of course, all of his Dark Brotherhood equipment. Which we will take all of. And uh, as much as I would like to play with this Dunmer physiology, I think I'll just dispose of this corpse for now. Now, I do believe I was actually trying to rest, so I'm going to try doing that again, and hopefully I won't be ambushed by more ridiculous assassins. Ugh. Dignity of some people. Let's say 16 hours. was sent to level 7. Ah, we don't even apparently have any modifiers this time. You resolved to continue pushing yourself. Perhaps there's more to you than you thought. Well, I guess we'll just have to use individual modifiers. What can you really do? Apparently it's from when the very last time you rested. So I'll have to do some more training, perhaps. I don't know. It certainly does seem to provide you with an incentive to rest after pursuing certain skills. Hmm. Is there any of this equipment he can actually use? He has magical gloves now, which are much better than the gauntlets that he had. He already has pauldrons. He hates the helmets. He already has a pair of the boots. No, I suppose he'll just have to sell them when he's ready. Or just practice some of his spells. How much does it uh, cost to cast? What's the likelihood of open any lock now? 30%. It's not that bad. I'd still like to practice more. But. Oh, to heck with it. Let's actually go see if we can open up that now. See what we can find in the depths of that vault that we found earlier. Might be fun. Alright. Practice. Rotate. Yes, hello. Take me to Sadrith Mora, please. And while we're way on the way to the vault, which we have to access through the crypt, we might as well practice our alteration magic. The alteration is that uh, willpower. Should also practice some of our intelligence increasing skills as well. On we go. 
Sam's actually been feeling rather chipper lately after everything he's managed to accomplish. Let's put him in rather good spirits. Okay, we're going to use a restore fatigue potion. Alright, alteration. Let's see. Illusion actually fortifies personality. Practice that some. 